Welcome to Raj Online Trainings. In the series of Hibernate 6 tutorial, in the last videos, we have seen the crude operations like uh, we have seen the how to insert a POJO class object into table, how to update the records, and how to get the list of records from the table. In this video, we will see how to delete the records of table using Hibernate 6 version. Here we are having the table. Uh, in MySQL database, student info table with this columns SNO, STUD name, and marks. And these are the records present in the table. Now we want to delete the records of this table using Hibernate 6 version. For that, let us go with the test class now. Under this SRC main Java, we are having the package com.hibernate6.test. Right click on this package and say new class student to delete with main method inside get the session factory session factory session factory equal to by using hibernate util all the method get session factory in the previous videos you can see how to get this session factory then open session 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 equal to session factory dot open session then begin the transaction session dot begin transaction import the packages now let us see the way to delete the records from table let us go with method one method one of deleting the records now just to create object of poser class student stud equal to new student and this student poser class belongs to the package com.hibernate6.entity.student and this POJA class student is mapped with the student info table which we have created in hibernate dot sorry this one student.hpm.xml where we mapped our POJA class student with student info table. So whenever we say student in our test classes it is connected to student info table of your database. Just create object of your project class student. Now point to the record which you want to delete. Point to the object which you want to delete like this. Stud dot set SNO based on primary key only. And I'm going with the primary key 111. So now we are pointing to the object whose student number is 111. Now by using session object, simply call the method remove and pass your object. That's it. This object will get deleted from the table. Now commit your transaction, close your session. Close your session. Run this piece of code, right click and say run as Java application. See it is selecting the record and deleting the record from table. And if you check your student info table of MySQL, and if you write here, select star from student info. See the record with primary key 111 has been deleted in the table now now let us see one more way of deleting the record from the table let us see method two so just to create a reference of student by using session object call the method get connect to the persistent class that is student dot class the entity class and go with the primary key two 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 so this get method will connect your student info table. Student means student info table with the primary key 222, goes to the table, pick up this record from the table with this serial number 222, primary key 222. And that record is now stored into this STUD object. Now by using this session object, call the method, remove and pass your object. That's it. So this method will delete the record from your table. Now run this piece of code run as java application see it is selecting and deleting and if you check your table we are now left out with three records so this 222 with serial number 222 has been deleted in the table now now the next object is we want to delete the records whose marks are greater than or equal to 400 we want to delete the records whose marks are greater than or equal to 400 means these two records will be deleted for us now 
let us see how to delete multiple records here that is our method three method three so this one is deleting multiple persistent objects for this make use of this interface selection query of type student query equal to session dot session dot create selection query and go with the query like from student where marks greater than or equal to colon marks where marks greater than or equal to colon marks and go with the persistent class name student dot class import the packages then say now query dot set parameter marks with what marks here foreign date we want to delete the records whose marks are greater than what foreign date so the query will become now from student where marks greater than or equal to colon marks means it is replaced with foreign date now to get the list of records make use of here list student student list equal to query dot list so this method based on the query it is going to pull out the records from table and stores into this student list import the package for list from java.util then traverse this for student std colon student list then pull out one one object and delete it by using session object call the method delete and or remove delete is deprecated in hibernate 6 make use of the method remove and pass your object pass the object that's it so this for loop will repeat until all the records gets completed based on this query based on our table these two records will be selected and these two records will be deleted now see when we run this application see it's selecting the records and deleting the records and if you check your table we are left out with only one record these two records are deleted now so in hibernate 6 we make use of which method remove method to delete the records and if you go with the previous versions instead of remove we make use of the method here we make use of the method instead of remove session dot delete method we use delete method to delete the objects from the table superior to hibernate six version instead of remove we use delete method and instead of this selection query we can even make use of uh, query interface in the previous version we can make use of what query interface to delete the records like this query query equal to session dot create query i'm just giving the code of older versions also for your reference query query equal to session dot create query from student where marks greater than or equal to colon marks if you see this type of code anywhere just remember these are older version code i'm giving for reference see here query dot set parameter marks with 400 then say list student student list equal to query dot list traverse here for student std colon student list then by using session object use the method delete so in the older versions of hibernate we use delete method and password object that's it okay. this is the way we write the code in older versions of hibernate in the latest version like hibernate 6 we use remove method and this selection query right so that's about all the crude operations where we have seen total crude operations like how to insert the objects into the table how to update the objects and how to delete objects and how to get the objects that is getting the records of the table from database and display the records on screen so these are about the crude operations in the next video we will be seeing how to go with criteria api using hibernate thank you please subscribe like and share